has right. three pools at it. Sure. Um, but so like we talked about under here, yeah. We just basically want to have this whole area out here usable. Sure. Um, as it is sloped and everything now, it's not usable. Okay. You have pictures of this already. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Um, the, uh, so I guess where these walls are, a wall dropping it down, have an upper area up here. Sure. A lower area down there. Okay. You know, the area under here we were talking about is the kitchen. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. And at some point you're going to have to build out the basement. Cut a door. Yeah. Yeah. And a I don't know when she wants that done. Sure. Um, and then we got a third floor. She said, I, "See, I just don't know what all of this is going to cost. What I should do first? What gets me the most bang for the buck?" Sure. Uh, let me give you some projections on that to help get some answers. All right. And I can get some projections on what I know about a shed in a 16 by 24. Right. Um, from what I know about this, um, an awful lot of the grass is going to turn into some other surface, whether it's right a concrete or a cobblestone or some kind of stone. Right. Or even stamped concrete for all I care, as long sure. as it looks nice. And the, the other thing is that... Uh, you want to go in or you want to stay out? Oh, it doesn't matter. Let's go um, ahead. we got to cut a hole in the, uh, the wall for the door. All right. And um, some kind of kitchen assembly underneath that porch. Right. There's already gas and power and everything 